Well, it is now 30 September. It's been a week since the last time I was out here with you guys. And uh, this is the tree that uh, I was standing by, uh, right near the uh, common man. And as you can see, a little bit of change further. Um, all depends on where you look today as to what kind of fall color you're going to be getting. Now, for those of you who are out here on uh, 30 September and this weekend, um, the places you're going to be looking for are up north, much further than the Hooks at Tolls. You want to be up in uh, maybe Dixville Notch. You want to be north of the White Mountains, over in the Northern Kingdom, uh, Vermont, and Northwestern uh, Maine. These are going to be your best areas. Now, um, I'm going to go over, I might get another cider donut at the Common Man over here. But uh, this is just my first for the uh, start of this weekend. And um, we'll talk to you a little bit later, see what we find up here on our trip to uh, northwestern Vermont. Talk to you later. Bye. Well, hello everybody, Jeff Foliage again, and today's still the uh, same trip I was on before. Today's the 1st of October, and we are in Crawford Notch. The, uh, as you can hear, the traffic is heavy on Route 302 today, and um, there's no change. It's always going to be like that. Uh, we pulled out just past um, the station, the AMC station up here in the Echo Lake, and just as you pass that, we pulled into the little parking lot, just past, uh, as you go in through the uh, narrow area, and then it widens out, and before you get to the Cascades, off to the right, there's a parking lot there. And um, as you can see behind me, there is some uh, pretty color. Um, I'm going to turn this around, let you see a little bit of what I'm looking at up here. And the... Um, the notch, uh, not looking too bad. I think the cell phone's gonna make it a little bit prettier than it really is, but it's not too bad. I think most of you are gonna be pretty happy with what I'm seeing so far. But the, uh, looking down the valley, it's not too bad. Loud, but not too bad. Okay, so what we've seen so far, we went up to Northwestern Vermont, uh, uh, not a lot of color and I did see a lot of brown trees a lot of bare trees um, that's going to be a continuing story for all of you um, you are going to see them don't panic over it because as you can see right here there is some very pretty color out there so if you're seeing only brown trees and falling leaves and that's it then you're in the wrong spot get back in the car and move real simple just move okay so we came across this morning uh, route 105 and we traveled um, up through Newport and uh, at the further east we went the much better the color got so route 105 I think if you I've been telling people 105 and 114 well I think you should take 114 go up um, right up snuggle up against the Canadian border and then you know, take it south into Canaan and, um, you know, do your traveling. I think it would be well worth your time. Route 105 on the eastern side of the uh, state of Vermont was quite pretty. Um, we came down through, uh, we hit Route 3, came down through Lancaster, and the colors were hit or miss. Um, in some spots, they were really good. Some spots were the trees have turned or they're turning but they're not bright colors. I think, you know, this coming week, we're not looking at great um, temperatures that I'd like. You know, the temperatures are warming up and the lows are not nearly as warm as I, or as cool as I would like to see. Um, and, but if you're gonna be up here this week, um, uh, from what I'm seeing so far, Crawford Notch, 
I'm betting Franconia Notch, uh, Cannon Mountain, uh, points north into New Hampshire. I would say the Northeast Kingdom, north to the Canadian border, and um, probably Maine, you know, Rangeley, uh, Greenville, Eustis, Stratton, all those areas in northwestern Maine should be looking really pretty. Okay, so I'll let you go with that. Get on the road and keep checking my updates on uh, New England Fall Foliage on Facebook. Okay, thanks a lot.